stop showing hate to homosexuals. Stop the hate towards a uh, homosexual. You know, and I'm making this video because I'm seeing a lot more people showing hate towards them. They are human. They are human, just like us. They're human, just like us. See, you know, it got so... It's so sad that this world is wishy-washy. This world is so wishy-washy. See, people, the real, true people of God, will speak against this stuff. Speaks against homosexuality and speaks against hate. Now, I, I speak against homosexuality. But in this video, I'm going to speak against the hate towards homosexuality. Yes, it's not right but what they do. But it don't give people no right to go out of their way to call them faggots or to try to threaten them to to kill them because they're they're gay even with lesbians you know don't show hate towards them see i don't believe in showing hate i don't hate anybody i might dislike your ways but i don't hate anybody at all you know see in this life you know in this life it's we live in a jacked up, messed up, corrupted world, y'all. But see, my thing about it is, yes, homosexuality will get worse because only because I say that is because of the way that they are promoting it nowadays. They are promoting homosexuality just y'all, it's so sad the way that they, they promote that that stuff the mess but um you know and that's gonna mess up the children's mindset because when they see this type of stuff on the tv the television y'all i even uh went in the library the other day and you know to do some work and i look on the shelf and that's that was the first thing that i seen as soon as i walked in the library they have books now of lesbians and gays. They have books. Children books. Children books. Come on now. But see. It's only. It, it is going to get worse. But see my thing is. It's okay to speak against it. But don't show. See a lot of people show hate. At the same time. No, don't show hate. Uh, God is not a, a God of uh, hate. I about to say Jesus, but it's the same person. He is not a God of hate. He don't show no hate towards anybody. But, you know, Jesus said when I come not to bring peace, but the sword. I come not to bring peace, but the sword. It's okay to speak against homosexuality. Because I'm going to continue to do it. But the thing about it is, it's a difference between speaking against something and showing hate. See, like I just said, this world is so wishy-washy. And the reason I said that this world is wishy-washy because it's okay to see. Now, I, I do understand that the Bible does say that a man should be manly. And a man should be manly. A man should not, is not okay for a man to have feminine ways it is not okay it is not okay for a man to to want to dress like a woman put makeup on like a woman it is not okay for a woman to want to dress like a man act like a man mess with other women like a man do it is not okay for any of that stuff but what i will say is you know don't show them hate speak preach the word to them but don't show hate don't come off aggressively. Uh oh, Hebrew um Israelites. Don't come off aggressively. You see, they love to go on YouTube and go out there. See, I, I think that's that's only for for show. You know, I think they do that only for show. You know, hey, look, I understand Jesus did go preach the word and stuff, but Jesus wasn't out there on a, on the street on the sidewalk calling gays and calling all the lesbians and gay dudes say, 
Oh, you, you faggots, you, you faggots, you going to hell, you going to hell, you, you on your way to hell, you going to hell. Jesus was not doing that. Jesus was not doing that. And they, they, they go out there and they go on a corner and screaming at people, disrespecting people and stuff and, and think that, that, uh, they really going to reach somebody. Now it's a, it's one thing that a woman said. In one of them videos that I've seen. And that stuck with me so hard. It stuck with me so hard because. My thing about it is. Don't come off so aggressive to people like that. If you're trying to reach somebody. Don't come off aggressive. Them Hebrew Israelites are doing it all so wrong. They're doing it. So God is not pleased with any of that stuff. He Yeah, yeah it's okay for you to preach the word to people. But he's not pleased with the way that you come at people like that. That's not the way to to approach them. Now, a lady said, "See, this is she went up to the man that was preaching against homosexuality. She went up against. She went. She went up. Walked up to him and said, see, this is the reason why church. Now, listen to what she said. Church people turned her heart." Away from the most high. Now you heard what she said right. The scriptures did not. Turn her heart away from the most high. Scriptures didn't. The bible didn't. But the people. Turned her heart away from the most high. The people. That's why it's so important y'all. For us to show compassion. That's why it's so important for us to. Preach. The word the right way, not showing hate, calling people out their names, bashing people. That's not what that's not what the most high wants you to do. He wants you to show compassion. That's not showing compassion by going up to people calling them faggots. Where where is that compassionate? Ain't no ain't no love in that. And and, and these people actually think that they're doing something right. You're not doing something right. That's not right. That's not okay. See, and then they go out there and, and they, they record it. They record themselves and put it on YouTube or anywhere that they post it at and record themselves screaming at people. See, them, them Hebrew Israelites, they go out there and they, 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 they got the Bible in their hand. And most of them be having dreads. They got the Bible in their hand and they, and they just, and, and just be screaming at people. Man, sit the hell down somewhere. You ain't doing nothing. You ain't reaching nobody by screaming at them. But see, this world is so, and I'm not just talking about the Hebrew Israelites. I'm talking about people in general. They so wishy-washy when it comes to it. So now, once again, I'm going to continue to preach against hom homosexuality. But then again, you see, you see, in this life right now, it's okay. They make it okay for two women to mess with each other. You know, they promote that. These hypocritical people in this life, they they make it okay for two women to mess with each other. But when when they see two men, oh man, they call them faggots. They they calling them, they threatening them. Some of them even killing them. That's not right. What makes you uh, just stop being wishy-washy? If one of them is wrong, then, then the other one is wrong. If two men being together is is not okay with you, then two women being together is shouldn't be okay also. Because you are seeing more of that nowadays. You are seeing more of that. You seeing more of of two women thinking that it's cute. To be a homosexual, to to be a lesbian, they 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 think that it's cute to be that. A lot of men just, you know, they they're that way because they, you know, some a lot of men are, are um in the closet. They ain't come out the closet. The want to be gangsters and stuff, they they gay. But my thing is, stop being wishy washy with it. If one is wrong, then then the other is wrong. Come on now. You know, and 
y'all, it's just, it's, like I said, just stop being wishy-washy. Just like you got that same energy with when you see two men being together, have that same energy for when you see two women be together. Have that same exact energy. Because both of it is wrong. Just like when I see two women, I a hey, look, I tell I tell two women, I even told family members, I say I say, hey, what you doing is wrong. You know, other other family members not gonna not gonna come up to you, not gonna tell you that. But what but I'ma tell you, it's wrong. See, I, I, other family members, they'll gossip, they'll just gossip about you. You know, but me, I'm I'm gonna go up to you to your face and, and tell you. And I'm going to do it out of love. I ain't going to bash you. I ain't going to show no hate towards you. I ain't going to sound like I'm angry or nothing. I'm just going to tell you what you're doing is wrong. And I, I might even tell you, and this is me talking to family. I might even tell you that, hey, people gossiping about you. People are talking about you, you know, talking about you with all this stuff. But I'm going to come to you, you know, boldly and tell you what you're doing is wrong. But stop being wishy-washy. Like I just said, you see with the same energy that y'all have when you see two men. And I'm not angry in this video. Why, why would I be angry about talking about this, about homosexuality? I'm not a homosexual. Don't plan on being one. Never was one. Never even had in my mind to be one. You know? And, uh, but I don't show no hate towards them at all. You know? I got a, I got a, um, um, addiction towards women. I got an addiction towards it. I don't fornicate, but my battle right now is women. It's just, you know, my battle right now is I'm battling, I'm trying not to go out here and fornicate. Because I see so many beautiful women, it's just so hard, you know? But I don't fornicate. But what I'm saying is, with that same energy that people have towards seeing two gay men, have that same energy when you see two women. And I'm not the end of this video, but I'm 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 mostly speaking about you know uh, just people in general. But I also see what Lil Boosie. I know y'all might know who Lil Boosie is, but he's a uh, he a rapper. He an older rapper, and he he uh you know what he does he he talked about he he talked about Lil Nas X and stuff yeah Lil Nas X is demonic he is in the wrong but but Boosie is demonic at the same time too what make Boosie any, any different from him Boosie out here promoting strippers he out here promoting lesbians but he he be so quick to talk about Lil Nas X let somebody who's right with the most high, let somebody who's actually living a righteous lifestyle say, uh, mention something uh, like that. Not Boosie. It would be different if Boosie was, um, if, if Boosie was, you know, living a holy lifestyle, godly, got out of that wickedness and stuff. But Boosie ain't living no, uh, Boosie ain't living no, no type of righteous lifestyle. And he shows you that. Because every time you go on YouTube, you see him on, you see him getting locked up somewhere. You know, you see him at, at the strip club. Yeah, same thing with Charleston White. Charleston White out around here preaching the word and stuff. He he said, "Oh well, man, I'm making money on on the internet just by talking." Hey, you can do that, but at the same time, you a hypocrite. Charleston White and Boosie, y'all hypocrites because you you call yourself a, uh, you know you. You out here speaking on, on this stuff, saying, oh, man, these dudes out here, they gang banging, they doing that and stuff. They out here killing, they out here robbing, you know, disrespecting dead people and stuff. But they doing the same exact thing. They doing the same exact thing, living the same exact lifestyle. Ain't nothing changed about them. But they out here talking about homosexual. They out here talking about that, but... They out here promoting stuff too. It's a lot of gay people in this world who promoting homosexuality, and they're gonna be punished for that. But stop being wishy-washy. Have the same energy with lesbians that you have with 
homosexuals, I mean, that you have with gay men, have the same energy with lesbians. So, y'all, I ain't about to say too much more in this video. Uh, like, comment, and subscribe. I'm out, y'all. Peace.